Hello, and welcome to my Star Wars The Old Republic Let's Play series. This is episode 13 of my series for the Republic scoundrel Myra Tell. We join her as she's racing Skavik to the vault in Zone Zero, trying to recover an artifact so she can find her way to the fantastic wealth of the dead pirate, Nock Drayden. So, we left right outside the last outpost so we could do the semi-exploration type quest on our way to the new zone. So let's go kill a rack door too. So we have to activate these pylons so they can drive the beasts away. And it looks like they're all on the main road. Second sensor or beacon. Third beacon. Convoy. There, better. We just stopped to rest. Geozel found a scratch, and we don't know if it's the Rakul infection, so we're waiting. And Ferdoan might be coming down with the Geonosian Swamp Flu, but we're on our way, I swear, and... You're looking at me very strangely. 
What are you expecting me to accuse you of? Nothing. I, I mean, I, I, I... Look, I know we're late, so people naturally start thinking... If you're gonna lie, at least do it well. I'm a terrible liar. I hate lying. All I ever wanted to do was serve the Republic. Fight some Imperials, see new parts of the galaxy. I never asked to be sentenced to this forsaken hole. So fine, we deserve it, alright? We're never going back there. I'd rather die. I know army life stinks, but don't they kill you or something if you desert? Prison on Coruscant. Which is way better than being stuck here. At least your family can visit. Five years we've been out here. No break. Most of our friends have died. We're wounded. Tired. Broken. Fighting something that can't think. Can't be frightened. And if you get the slightest scratch, you become the enemy and your own squad puts you down like a dog. You have given the Republic as much as it can reasonably demand. You're not gonna turn us in? You'll never survive alone out here. We're heading back near the main base. There are scavengers with ships there. Maybe we can make it off-world. Please, tell Commander Yajak you found our bodies. That way no one will ever come looking. Okay. So we assist them with deserting. And I'm surprised Corso agreed with that. State your business. This is a Republic military outpost. Sovereign territory of the Galactic Republic. We will defend ourselves with deadly force if necessary. Do you have some reason to fear an invasion? There's no unauthorized travel this far into the wilds. Best policies usually blast first, chat later. Don't suppose you were sent by Commander Guarded with news about our supplies. Your supplies are on the way, but no thanks to him. Sounds like there's a story there, but I won't waste your time asking for it. Let me just say thanks. Don't suppose you saw any sign of our boys. If they're still alive, they'd better have a good excuse for leaving us hanging. I found their bodies along the route. No surprise. Ah, well, they'll be missed. I'll send their uniforms home to their kin. Anyway, thanks for the help and the news. This sure won't help morale. Everyone else will just have to work a bit harder now. That ought to fix you. Ooh, lots of quests. Stand by for examination and suggested products. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Okay. Archivist Wintag. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> Something in the air. Spores, I think. Name's Wintag. I'm working on the Republic Teresian Archival Database. We call it Reptat. I'm assigned... <clears throat> to explore the old city myself, but I'm uh, <clears throat> not handling the change of atmospheres very well. I don't suppose you'd be up for a little job exploring the ruins? We're well-funded, so I can pay you for your trouble. Wait, what was that first part? I didn't hear anything before the word pay. If you can do this, the Republic will be falling over themselves to reward you. I'm talking about finding the Archive set up by Terrace's own government to preserve their knowledge and culture in the event of disaster. I've been working on this for years, and I believe I've finally pinpointed the location of their Archive. Just tell me where, and I'll bring it back for you. 
I, uh... From the records? It sounds like it may be more than a simple data file. I've tried to approach the location before, but it is positively overrun with raccoons. I couldn't get close. If you could get past them, let my assistant know how to arrange retrieval. Her constitution is stronger than mine. Achoo! Kapa Tonga, Chisa Bicha Wonka Ki Atocha. Esupuda Nupajunki, Baguta Ji Uta Vukise. Bafupa Gi Wanta Humpa, Muli Rabamba Wula. I just got here, bring me up to speed. Oi pa moja chapukala, chanu sa usa be mota. Sayatupe, nu avachikuna, chino nik titoki. I'll work every angle I can. Ukili, baklunki na atabumpa, pushuda. Chitonka, lishlika changa, bumpa kombokni. Hey, one more quest to pick up. Would you like a chance to be part of one of the great mysteries of the Republic's past? We have irrefutable proof that Revan once sheltered here, soon after returning to the Republic from the Sith. There are many tales of how Revan rescued Bastilashan and changed galactic history, but there were smaller lives touched as well. Get to the point. I am Hackenburge, historian from the Galactic Library on Coruscant. I am undertaking one of the most important historical research projects of our lifetime. Three hundred years ago, the outcasts of Taris lived deep below the city, where the Rakgul Plague originated. Revan's journals record bringing them a cure for the plague and leading them to the secure colony called the Promised Land. Yet we don't know if they survived. Are you asking me to look for a lost colony from three hundred years ago? Or any sign of what became of them. My assistant is coordinating excavations. Anything you find, bring to him. Perhaps these promised ones left some record. Something to talk to us across the ages. Okay. We will go to Transport Station 5, it looks like. So this is a part of the destroyed city. And we probably got a bonus quest that to kill a feature. bunch of these things. Twenty-five of them. No, twelve of them. Oh, 
now we have to kill the silver ones. We are saved. An upworlder has restored to us the work of my grandfathers. At last, we have a place to escape this oppressive city and the laws that keep us beneath it. A place where we can breathe. Okay. Um, we're gonna go north. Behind you, Captain. Hopefully there's one more in here. This will be no secret to anyone listening. But Terrace has been attacked. The upper and lower city were destroyed. We have found the promised land, but have nowhere to return to. If only we had arrived sooner. The Promised Land is the original Terrace colony site. It was sheltered from the direct bombardment. But the quakes have destroyed every building and generator left. We must start again from scratch. But at least we have survived. The Rack Ghouls are still feeding on the dead. But when the meat is gone, they will begin to hunt. I think this silver back here will give us credit. who brought us out of the Undercity and into the Promised Land. We have sent scouts throughout Paris and can find no other survivors. They cast us out and bar their doors to us. But now we bury our dead in the ashes of their skyscrapers. As Rukel told us, 
It is not an easy life. Our children will grow up in a world of spears and bows, not blasters and starships. It is my burden to preserve our memories. Once we were outcasts. Once we were the promised ones. Now we are Taris. Breeding back in the Undercity. They reproduced only by infecting us. But now, there are more every day. We lose people to them. A few every year. But only us meet. The serum the Upworld have brought us has held true. We do not sicken. But now the serum is gone. We have had four infants born who could not be immunized. All boys. We will not be able to protect them forever. We need our full strength to defend the tribe. Maybe the immunity was inherited. Maybe we do not need to worry that a bite, a scratch, will turn our children against us. Maybe I do not need to fear for my son. So... Not only did the rat ghouls... Um, be, get more by infecting people, but now it looks like uh, the rat ghouls are breeding, which is never a good sign having breeding zombies out there. I hope I went the right direction first. Better? I totally forget from when I did this on my trooper. I think I went the other way first. I don't know if I have to come back up here. But we're going to try to stealth by as many as we can. I'm going to save my rocket booth for the next stealth. Fix it.
I'm looking for a weapons cache. I am Kuki, 14th Keeper of Memories after Rukil. We now number 53 adults and 21 children. We lost four abled bodies and two child bearers to the Rakgul virus this year. Our records say there used to be a cure. We have lost so much. Tomorrow, we leave to search for higher ground. Plants are growing. Nature has reclaimed what once belonged to men. Nature is cruel. Two of every three of our babies die to sickness and hunger. If we are to live, we must rebuild our walls. Now in the archive. Who mail? I just did that to see if uh, I needed any bonus missions there. UM-35. This is a restricted area. There have been no security breaches for the past 111,325 days. Please show your credentials to enter. Have you been guarding this place for 300 years? That is correct. My programming appears to contain a contradiction. I'm instructed only to open this door to a member of the Tauritian government. But when the archive was brought online, all members of the ruling government were contained within. I have received no information on their successors. This place has been a wasteland for 300 years. There is no government. Ah, let me update my programs. My fall through under that condition is to open only to representatives of the Galactic Republic. Is uh, that you? Of course it is. Yeah, I, uh, do some work for the Republic now and then. Excellent. Welcome to the Terrace Archive. They are all in Carbonite. This is the ruling government of Terrace, as last appointed, plus representatives of every major science and industry. Their final wish was to be thawed when Terrace was once more in the hands of the Republic. Here is data on all those contained within. I won't blow this. Trust me. My programming instructions end here.
I don't want to go all the way back to the entrance, because I still have... other things to do here. Here, elevator. That ought to fix you. Yeah. No entrance yet. Now to slice the vault door. Let's see if Skavix guys are here. Cairn and weapons cache. I'm going to do the weapons cache first so I don't accidentally lose the bonus quest. Probably gonna have me kill somebody. God. I am the memory. I have Rukil's descriptions. I know there was a city once. I know a city is many houses, many people. I am the only one. Now, there is just us. We have stopped having children. The old records say it is from toxic radiation. We once called this the Promised Land. It was a lie. It is our grave. I think you're all right. Okay, and now to look for the vault. Okay, they're evading. We're going to... Just run out. Okay, none of the hired gunmen are needed. Oh. 
What the? Who the? How'd you? You are one ugly pile of scrap, aren't you? How dare? What are you? This is first-rate battle armor. We've been through ten kinds of pain getting to this vault, and not to watch you open it first. Skavik, you there? You want to see this, boss? We're at the vault, but we're not alone. <laughs> so perfect. I love it when everything comes together like this. How's life treating you, Captain? You enjoying my ship and all my stuff? What about that two-faced Risha? We're doing great, thanks. Yeah, I bet you girls stay up late, listening to music, talking about who you'll marry when you grow up. Still owe you for that mess on Coruscant. You have any idea the grief I'm taking? I could kill everybody who cracks a joke, but uh, that's a lot of work. So why don't you just die already? I can't die until I get Noctrain's treasure. And maybe not even then. That's my prize, Captain. And I don't plan to share it. Roxer, I want you and the boys to spare no effort killing my friend, and make it as painful as possible. You heard the boss. Fry this fool! Quick wipe. Okay. We're going to stealth. Speed. Ooh. That was worth unstealthing for. There. Better? Need to look at the map. What do we have left? We have the exit. So we're gonna go do the heroic. We're gonna just bamf to the heroic. Cause everything else looks like turn in, turn in, turn in. Used all my energy. Ouch. Yeah, I probably should have got a anti venom. Let's see. See if he has one. Welcome to our market, potential customer. Mm. 
No. Um. There. Better. Nope. Thank There's you a for chance. your patronage. Looks like the max I can lose on my health for rat ghouls is five. And then each successive one refreshes it. Got an interesting idea of fun. Okay.
Speak with Dr. Zalarin. Manuk Marakanaja, Ki Namabam, Yak Manana. You got a name? Jukaki mem paninu, am kabina pek mem no kimgam. Umluk inu mem no, am kakam mem perolak palak. Okay, we are going to teleport back to This camp. There. So I do know there's at least one more heroic left on this planet, and we'll get it at the. Uh, wrong way. How do I get out of here? There we go. We're just going to go turn this quest in. I was told you might be coming. Was there anything in the archive? Apparently, the ancient Teresian government thought the most important thing to preserve was themselves. Themselves? What do you... Do you mean literally? That's amazing. All this time we've been working from old recordings and the occasional droid when the key to the whole planet's history is right here. A Republic Zone at the Orless Reclamation Base, so we are going to go back to the original base, turn those in. <clears throat> We are going to grab the, uh, last two heroics. That's the one to go back to my ship. Your supervisor sent me. I found out what happened to your promised ones. There's no happy ending. I knew they couldn't have disappeared without a trace. Give me what you found. Let us learn the history of this doomed planet so we don't repeat it. Go turn this one in. We are going to go a little bit long on this one because I do want to get those heroics done to get the weekly done. I'm going to actually uh, check the weekly. Um, there. Better? We got four out of five. We only have to do one. Let's do that one.
Bunny. Five of these are radiated ones. Rackles have infested an abandoned reactor deep in Tular on Marsh. Laris Kozak and his men attempted to clean the reactor out, but were slaughtered by irradiated beasts. Desperate for someone to finish the job, Laris has asked for your help. Head to the abandoned reactor and defeat the irradiated Rackles. Two more, and then probably something to do after I kill them. Um... It would have to do something to activate the reactor. But we can stealth if we need to. We're going to abandon that one. 
And we are going to go in. Oh, mail. Private Sakal, Non Human Relations. A little while ago, you helped some of us out with a dispute regarding property rights, something going back a few centuries to when humans and non-human relations on Taurus were ugly, to put it mildly. Wanted to let you know what's happened since. Word spread of your that you favored the non-humans and angry messages poured in from across the Republic. We also had a reporter in the other day, and people are starting to discuss it in the street. Not pushing and shoving discussions, but real actual talks. I'm just a grunt. Don't have a clue if this will end with an official government apology and offers of restitution, or if it'll just fade away. But it's open now, and that has to be a good thing. Okay, I am not going to bamf straight to my ship. Just in case, like we had before. Um, after you complete a class story on planets, there are... Additional quest chains. We're not doing those. So we are going to go this way just in case Skavik is here. I don't want to uh, miss that and have to leave the ship. But I don't know because I have not done this class. So we're going to go on our ship and we're going to talk to Risha. You got the astrogation chart, didn't you? I can tell by the look on your face. Did you ever doubt me? If I did, you've just made me a believer for life. That astrogation chart belonged to an exchange gangster named Davik Kang. Davik personally mapped dozens of hyperlanes between the core and outer rim systems. He found shortcuts and hideouts all over the galaxy. I've never heard of this Davik Kang. He was the last great leader of the Exchange Crime Syndicate, and the unofficial ruler of Taris. Have you studied much galactic history, Captain? Interesting patterns emerge if you pay attention. Davit Kang's criminal empire ended when this planet was destroyed. Nock Drayan's empire was born when he destroyed a planet. What a bloodthirsty creep. That's one way to look at it, assuming you're ignorant of the actual facts. Once upon a time, there was a pirate haven on the Outer Rim called Mandelia. Thousands of criminals lived there. One bright morning, Nock Drain's freighter dropped out of hyperspace over Mandelia. He demanded the pirates surrender to him or die. Pirates aren't known for surrendering. They weren't afraid of a lone, lightly armed freighter. They thought Nock was crazy. When the pirates sent their reply, Nock launched a single rocket at their settlement. The warhead was tipped with an Imperial nerve toxin. The entire settlement died in less than a minute. How many people did Nock murder? 10,000 greedy pirates, give or take. Ouch. That day at Mandelia, Nock Drain went from being a low-rent smuggler to one of the richest criminals in the galaxy. Anyway, that's how the legend goes. I should probably let you get back to work. Is there a plan to use that astrogation chart? I'll upload these coordinates into your Navi computer. It'll take a while, though. I don't recognize some of these stars. At any rate, I'm ready to leave Taris. I'm sure we can find someplace more interesting to be. Got a bad case of wanderlust, Risha. Hey, it's one of my best qualities. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to our bridge. And... We are going to travel to Narshida. Except I have to activate the quest for it to show. 
without me having to search for it. And that's where we're going to conclude episode 13 of my Star Wars The Old Republic Scoundrel Let's Play. Join us next time as we continue to follow the exploits of Myra Tell as she goes on search for one of the keys of Nox Draymond's wealth on the planet of Nar Shadda. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and click the bell so that you're notified of new content. You can also check out my other playlists that cover the other storylines for the various Old Republic classes. I ask that you leave me comments, either positive or negative, as they help me improve my content. Again, thank you, and show me the credits.